This next episode of Georgia in Flight is about Hazel Vanes, Georgia's first female pilot. Hazel Jane Vanes was born April 21, 1916, in Waynesboro, Georgia. She was born with asthma and height condition, which under modern aviation standards would stop her from becoming a pilot. Vanes grew up in Macon and graduated from Wesleyan College in 1936. After her graduation, she was dared to become a pilot. She stayed at the Herbert Small Airport and became the first woman to receive a pilot's license in the state of Georgia. She also earned a commercial pilot's license and flew with the Eastern Airlines. She became a stunt flyer and became popular in the Macon area. At the start of World War II, she joined the civilian pilot training program. Vange was one of 25 women chosen in 1942 to ferry planes for the British Royal Air Force. The plane was created by Jackie Cochran, who was covered in a previous video. Vane's logged more flight hours than any other woman. She only crashed once, when his Spitfire malfunctioned and landed on a house. When the Women's Air Force Service Pilots Organization, also called the WASP, was formed in 1943, Vane's became a test pilot. The WASP was disbanded in 1944, and Vane's became an instructor for the Brazilian Air Ministry. In 1949, she was given a reserve commission in the U.S. Air Force. She became the first female reserve pilot called into active service when the Korean War began. She acted as an advisor for women's pilots programs in the United States and British militaries. On September 4, 1956, she suffered a fatal height attack in London. She was buried in Macon, Georgia. Hazel Vance flew over 6,400 hours during a 20-year career. Today, she is called Georgia's first lady in flight.